All right, I, that I, that brings me to another cool stuff found with a little more show and tell. The Yamaha E seven hundred A over the ear headphones. So these are three hundred and fifty dollars headphones. They have forty millimeter drivers, which is uh, pretty standard for high end. Uh, over the ear headphones, Apple's $550 AirPods Max also have 40 millimeter drivers. Still not sure why we pay an extra $200 for those, but that will, we'll, you know, there you go. you you can choose, um, these Yamaha ones, super comfortable. They come in a, a case and then you open the case and the headphones happily fit inside it. And, uh, and they, they really do. They're these, these ear cups are big which I really like. They fit over my ears in a very nice way. Uh, and they, they look good. And of course they have all kinds of great technology in them. The first thing I will say though, is that they sound fantastic. These are truly built to be, you know, high end headphones. They have a listening care feature that adapts the sound based on what it hears in your ear. Like it, it, it've got microphones both inside and out. It's got a, uh, you know, you can use it as a, uh, you know, Bluetooth speakerphone, of course. And, uh, but the microphones inside are constantly sensing much like what Apple's doing and many other manufacturers are doing with their headphones now where they're adapting the sound to you. Bluetooth five with Aptex adaptive. So it's got the, the latest and greatest uh, as far as that goes. Ambient sound reduction now or ambient sound. It'll allow in. It's got active noise cancellation all by themselves. These are closed ear headphones. So all by themselves, they block out quite a bit of sound. Um, and you can turn noise cancellation off. Of course, with noise cancellation on, they, it really dries out the environment, which is sort of what it should do. And the ambient mode, which lets sound in is one of the best ambient modes I've used. A lot of headphones have it. Um, and it can be sort of flaky. It might not let enough in. It might let too much in. This, to me, lets a perfect amount in. Uh, I really can hear my environment, but still hear the music. In fact, of the three, I was listening to a bunch of music on these, John. And of the three modes, the um, with noise canceling off and with ambient on, I noticed almost no difference in the sound. Obviously, I could hear ambient noise. So if I was in a quiet environment, I, I noticed no difference. If I was where you are, where the cars are driving by, then I might hear those. And that's you know either a good thing or a bad thing. But in terms of audio quality, it was the same all the way through. When I turned on noise cancellation, I definitely lost some low end on the headphones. And to me, it was, it was lost low end, not the other way around, not extra low end when it, you know, when it was off, if that makes sense, because you could look at it both ways. But I have a playlist of songs that I'm very familiar with that I use to test earphones so I can suss them out in a snap. And, and this definitely, you know, cut some of those that I don't want to say low mids. It was, it was truly kind of some of the low end was out when the noise cancellation was on, at least sitting in my office. I, I do plan to bring these on the plane, I think. Uh, they've got like 30 hours of battery life. There's a, there's an app that you can use both to update the firmware and also to control all the various settings, but they, you can control all the noise cancellation and everything right from buttons on them. And what's really nice, John, is when you hit the, you know, noise cancellation button to change it or hit the power button, it talks to me. So I don't have mm -hmm. to just hear a sound and wonder what mode I've changed to. It tells me in English what mode I've changed to, or if I tap the power button, it tells me the state of the battery, high, medium, low. It's great. So I'm, I'm impressed with these things. And 350 or 349.95 on Amazon, that's about what I would expect to pay for high-end headphones that do all the things these do. And they do have, you can plug into them too. So if you want to plug into like the airplane output or your iPad or whatever, you can, you know, you can do that too. So.